and I have an exam so I'm going to probably take you guys around with me and like on campus or whatever but this is what I typically wear to I don't normally beat my face I'm lying um I just did that today because I just felt like doing my makeup but this is what I'm wearing to class Like t-shirt focus okay come on girl okay so a turban this isn't even a turban this is like a scarf that I got like a winter scarf and then like a white tee this camo jacket and I have on some ripped jeans and then some black sandals so yeah like I said I'm gonna take you guys with me for the day that little subtle highlight and um so you can see what I basically do like when I prepare for an exam this is my first exam by the way and all right so I'm in the car I'm about to drive to school um in the back is trash uh, like recyclables and stuff because where I live um they like take the trash to the dump or whatever so I'm gonna show you guys what I typically pack because Mondays are like super duper long I don't even work on Mondays because that's just too much um so i'm gonna show y'all what i pack for my class so i i got audi water because audi water is cheap i have like five bottles of water three of them right here um i got some cashews literally all my stuff came from audi because audi super cheap i never stop eating oodles and noodles and i don't care how get out looking class i'm still gonna eat oodles and noodles then i got a banana and i got two type of ziploc bags one's healthy one's unhealthy so in this bag i have some uh black grapes or whatever purple grapes some strawberries and then i have some clementines and then in this bag i have some granola bars so i have chocolate oatmeal i also have like four packs of fruit snacks and then like a fruit and multi-grain apple cinnamon bar and then in the library and also in my uh hall where i have classes at they have a microwave so i bought me some butter popcorn Ooh, and oh i got napkins in my glove department so what the heck is this on me is this a bug i don't think so whatever um so that's pretty much what i would pack like on a typical monday to class i like to bring hella 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 snacks because i know i get hungry and i don't really want to buy anything while i'm at school and on campus because i'm also trying to save my money what the heck i thought i dropped that off anyway so it's raining per usual like always in atlanta but i just had to go like drop the recyclables in a dumpster and i just want to let y'all know that was a humbling experience because i had to actually touch the trash and everything with my hands like i am like blown away i wanted to talk about like learning how well i'm learning how to vibrate at a higher frequency I'm trying to figure out how to vibrate at a higher frequency because i feel like i'm reaching that point but as I said in my last video, like what I'm noticing is that when you reach that level of like positivity or like, you know, that ultimate like state of bliss, people can can tell that, you know. So I think like what I'm going to start doing is just pretty much ignoring like the negative aspects of what people may say, people may do. Like anything that is negative that may necessarily bother me from another person, I'm just pretty much going to like try to ignore that and learning how to forgive so moving forward i'm gonna learn how to forgive like people do things because they're hurt so hurt people hurt people like in personal relationships just just anything you know so it's two of the ways that i'm going to try to vibrate at a higher frequency which is learn to forgive people because people just don't know sometimes and then also like just show constant gratitude for like what it is that i have like i'm always worrying about like how am I gonna handle this? How am I gonna take care of this? How am I gonna take care of that? But then like once I like like push it out to the universe, there's always been a time where like it was taken care of and I didn't have to worry about it. So I'm um, so gonna like just pretty much show gratitude every day and just be thankful for what I have. Like not even worrying about what I don't have. Like, you know, like thankful that I have a roof, thankful that I had a bed to sleep in, thankful that I have food every day, water to nourish my body, like just things like that. Thankful that I have some people that surround me and although that there may be negative people that surround me sometimes like just knowing not to give that my energy because once you give that negativity or that negative person your energy is just like 
that's it you know like like you've given them a piece of you and learning how to vibrate at a higher frequency is learning to not even give people a piece of you and when they see that you don't give them a piece of you they be mad like and you know that's just how life is just gonna have to unfold this stuff like people are just gonna have to be mad that you don't really want to like i can't stop saying like but people are just gonna have to be upset that you don't want to necessarily fully indulge in what it is that they trying to give to you like i was talking to my mom and she was like you know what the devil's knocking but that doesn't necessarily mean that you let them in that's gonna show the other person that you are the bigger person so it's crazy because I said I was going to drive and like record or whatever, but I figured out how to do it. And I think this is super cool. Yeah, so I'm going to just continue to do that. Just moving forward, vibrate at a higher frequency. Know that ultimately my blessings are going to come. The universe is going to literally manifest all of my intentions that I've been saying on my crystals. Like I know it's going to happen. And when it does happen, like I said, I'm going to be so freaking hype, bruh. Like oh it's just so many things so many things so many things and i'm just super duper hyped because i know it's all gonna work itself out and when it works itself out i'm going to be so happy like like i'm literally going to document my life like i think i'm gonna do a video every week about like what's going on with me like i said and just like watch like i want to be able to look at the video and like play it back and be like damn remember you said such and such and such and such like yo all right y'all let me let me drive because i do want to play some music before i like start this exam and get myself hype or whatever and i need to let y'all know my two motivating songs um freaking cardi b get up 10 that's my song uh it's by lucci shit dream dream by yf and lucci like that's my song so i'm gonna play those and then i'm gonna come back uh once i get to school all right so i just got to school it literally took me like almost an hour because of how far i live and freaking traffic but um it's 306 and i had to go to like a couple offices and stuff i needed a snack so i'm eating my banana i have to go to, like a couple offices and stuff class starts at 5 5 15 I want to say five. I don't know. I don't remember, but I'm always there before the professor, so that's all that matters. Um. So yeah. So class starts at five, and then five, five fifteen, whatever. No, five, because it's over at seven fifteen. Yeah. So class starts at five. It's like three something. So I'm gonna run in here, go to a couple of these offices, handle some stuff, and then I'm gonna go to the library. I'm thinking an hour and a half. That's like good timing to like complete a test, right? So freaking skinny, and my clothes are like always falling off of me like regardless like look oh, look at my clothes so damn big so weird holding up my camera and like vlogging this is why i don't vlog because i look so weird but whatever you just gotta embrace it okay so i just made it to the library so funny i mean i'm in a study room so i can be loud but it was super funny because as i was like going to the bathroom before i take the test i see my professor maybe that's a sign from the universe letting me know that you know, I'm going to actually pass this thing. I mean, I don't know. Whatever y'all know, I'm going to take signs how I can get them. But and I asked a ton of questions before. So, um, I have my notes here. My snacks. So, freaking textbook that I have to use for this class. I don't know whose stuff that is. I don't want to erase it now because maybe they might need it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to help everybody in grad school because this shit is serious. But, yeah, so... I'm gonna like <clears throat> study for like 20 minutes. I'm so nervous. Like, I don't know why I let my. This is my first graduate test. Like, I think that's why I'm so nervous. Like, study for a little bit. And then I'm gonna take the test. I may or may not come back on here and let you guys know what grade I got. I don't know, but I'm gonna think positive. I'm gonna pass this test. Meditate real quick and put it out to the universe. I'm gonna pass this test. And that's just gonna be the end of it. I looked at the time and it's almost five and I gotta go to class. So I think what I'm gonna do is after I get out of class, probably come back and then finish the test because as I go home, I know that I'm not gonna be able to finish it. Uh, when we was talking about that higher vibrations and frequency and all that other stuff and like, yeah. 
not being around them negativity so yeah i know if i go home i'm not gonna be able to finish it but um it wasn't as bad as i thought oh that book bag is so heavy oh my gosh it really wasn't as bad as i thought it was gonna be um i confident mainly because i don't know like i don't know we'll see what happens but i need to hurry up and get on the other side of campus because class starts at five i'm already late but she seen me taking the test so that's a good thing i am still like at school and damn near an hour maybe like 20 minutes stay up my foundation hasn't done pretty good for today but like i'm trying to stay up and i'm freaking holding off and i didn't even 